and welcome to the Gospel Minute from St. Michael's Orthodox Church in Geneva, New York. I'm Steve Toby. Today is the first Saturday of Souls. On the four Saturdays of Souls, we remember those who have died, and special prayer services are held in Orthodox churches. Saturday holds a special significance on the Orthodox calendar, for it was Saturday that our Lord lay dead in the tomb before his resurrection. So check with your church and see if there is a Saturday of Souls service at your church today and the next two Saturdays, as well as the Saturday before Pentecost. Today's Gospel is from St. Luke, chapter 21, verses 8 and 9, verses 25 through 27, and verses 33 through 36. Before we hear today's Gospel, let's pray for understanding with Father Gregory. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Illumine our hearts, O Master, who lovest mankind with the pure light of thy divine knowledge. Open the eyes of our mind to the understanding of thy gospel teachings. Implant also in us the fear of thy blessed commandments, that trampling down all carnal desires, we may enter upon a spiritual manner of living, both thinking and doing such things as are well-pleasing unto thee. For thou art the illumination of our souls and bodies, O Christ our God, and unto thee we ascribe glory, together with thy Father, who is from everlasting, then all holy good and life-creating spirit, both now and ever to ages of ages. Amen. And now today's Gospel according to St. Luke. And he said, Take heed that you are not led astray, for many will come in my name, saying, I am he, and the time is at hand. Do not go after them. And when you fear of wars and tumults, do not be terrified, for this must first take place but the end will not be at once. And there will be signs in sun and moon and stars, and upon the earth distress of nations and perplexity at the roaring of the sea and the waves, men feigning with fear and with foreboding of what is coming on the world, for the powers of the heavens will be shaken. And then they will see the Son of Man coming in a cloud with power and great glory. Heaven and earth will pass away, but my words will not pass away. But take heed to yourselves, lest your hearts be weighed down with dissipation and drunkenness and cares of this life, and that day come upon you suddenly like a snare. For it will come upon all who dwell upon the face of the earth. But watch at all times, praying that you may have strength to escape all these things that will take place, and to stand before the Son of Man. The Word of God. Well, have a good day, everybody. And I'll see you again tomorrow. And may God bless us all. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Oh, give thanks unto the Lord. Lord.